coming into the match. Denise Dumble, the middle blocker, is a sister who throws discus at UCLA. A tough family. <laughs> After the substitution, Mike Puritz calls timeout, not happy. And again, talking to Meredith Fletcher and the rest of the Anteaters. Act Hawaii has beaten these teams more than anybody else without a loss. Fullerton, Hilo, Irvine, that's right, Irvine, New Mexico State, and Arlington. Those are the top five opponents against whom Hawaii has a perfect record. Those aren't the only teams, those are just the five big ones. Teams that hope to never play Hawaii again, perhaps. Off the timeout, Chase and Amo. Right, Sarah Chase just getting a lot of blocks this year with theoretically the weak link in the blocking scheme, Chris, the setter, and that was all Amo. She blocked line really well there, turned her outside hand in. Good technique, and now they go outside again. This time over the block, Amo, short set. Chase doesn't like the kill, but she'll take it. 12-4. Chase hitting 600 now after struggling last week. Timing seems to be a little better with Robin Amo, although the last one wasn't real clean. I think the timing overall tonight is much better. 13-4. Here comes Wendy Parkin to serve as you watch this point. There's a tall and short of it right here. I see Williams putting it down, and the uh, shortest player in Hawaii squad at 4-7. Wendy Park comes in for the tallest player, Angelica Jungqvist. Ball off key, off the block, and now Chris, tell you how deep Hawaii is. Not only all the regular positions up front does Hawaii have a battle for, Wendy Park is battling for that back row specialist position with Chastity Kanoa. You're right. Wendy's coming in and serve two tough serves. She may get game point right here. Robin Amo lets that one drop, and it's side out for the Anteaters. Chevron Gasolines with the cleansing power of Tech Berlin, a simple way to help take care of your car. Chevron, simply smarter. Pass by Wendy Park there. Great dig by Edwards. What a set by Meredith Fletcher that time. Holy cow, great back bump set. Longest rally of the night. Nice back set. Wendy Park got a piece of it. Brooks and Rainbow's all over the floor, can't get back. Chase and Williams stumbling and bumbling and good point. Crowd appreciates the hustle of both players and both teams. Well, you know, you can tell Irvine is, is probably about a month away. That's what Pierre had said. He's just now settled into a lineup within the last six or seven days, and he's got a mixture of veterans and rookies, and I think they will be good, but it might be a little bit too late. Okay, Williams shanks one, 6-14. Watch for the serving signal here. It looks like he's getting no signal. He's talking to Fletcher, telling him where he wants this next pass to go. Here's a free ball, so Fletcher will have an opportunity to put it where she wants. Back sets. Well, he can't get a clean swing to get the side out. And a ball is missed. And these Dumble just miss hit that one. So now Hawaii. We'll try to end it. game number two. Robin Amo. And they do it with a block. 15 to 6. Game number two to the Rainbow Lahine. They lead big time here on K5, the home team. 